In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a magnifying effect in Photoshop. We're going to do it a couple different ways. One way without a magnifying glass, the other way with a magnifying glass. If you want to use the magnifying glass I'm using in this tutorial, I have left a link below uh, that you can download it. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to select our background and we're going to duplicate it. We can do it by right click and duplicate layer or we can go up to the layer menu and duplicate layer. Now we have background copy. With background copy selected, we want to go up to edit, transform, excuse me, edit free transform. And once the transform bar shows up, we want to select the uh, chain here to keep aspect ratio. And we're just going to enlarge that a little bit. And once that's enlarged, we're going to commit. The background copy is still selected. We're going to go to our elliptical tool. And we're going to shift click so we can maintain a perfect circle. In the area that we want to magnify, we'll adjust it to where, right where we want it. And then, once we have that selection made, we're going to go up to select inverse then we're going to hit the delete key now we're back to our original background with the exception of the selection that's still magnified and go up and hit select deselect and there you go that's one way to do it let's do it with a magnifying glass though okay now we're going to do it with the magnifying glass so first thing we want to do is select our background duplicate that layer with that uh, background copy selected, we're going to go to Edit, Free Transform, and once Free Transform bar shows up, we're going to click on the little uh, link there to maintain the aspect ratio, and we're going to enlarge the picture so, and we'll commit to that. And now let's bring our magnifying glass in. Going to pull up that picture, we'll press the Select tool. We're going to bring it in, we're going to hold and shift click, maintain aspect ratio, uh, to resize, place it where we want our magnifying effect to be, Let's select, background copy selected, we want to Uh, select our marquee tool, elliptical marquee tool. Go inside of our magnifying glass, hold shift click, maintain a perfect circle here. And let's move it. And then we're going to go up to select, these, uh, excuse me, uh, select transform selection. And we're going to bring the selection just to the inside edge of the my, uh, magnifying glass. And we'll commit that. Then we'll go up select, inverse, hit the delete key. And now we're back to our original uh, background uh, with our uh, magnified section not being affected. Alright. So let's go up to select, deselect, and we can right click in our magnifying glass, we'll select blending options, and we're going to select inner shadow. And we're going to select blend mode darken. Opacity, we'll say 60. Uh, angle will be 100. Distance will be 5 and size will be 50. Once you have that selection, uh, once you have that made, just select OK. We we'll go to the layer menu, and we want to flatten the image. And there you got it. That's all there is to it.